When I hit 9,000 subscribers, I'm going to be doing a 9-hour Skywars stream. So if you like the video, subscribe, and I'll see you in the games. So today I'm going to be playing some unnicked Skywars with all of my sweatiest cosmetics. So we have Notes Trail, Magic Box because I don't have any other cage, Super Sheep, Purple Tornado, and Monster Bird because it's like a ranked add-on or something. And of course we have the Flex Kill messages to show off our 200 and like... 59,000 kills or 54,000. It's very late at night, by the way, so I'm not expecting too much. I just did a couple of test games to see how, how you know, how the lobbies are, how wholesome people are, and I'm getting a lot of wholesome people. It's actually very, very nice. But yeah, I'm going to start off every single game by saying good luck and see if I get any reactions like that. <laughs> That's, wow. I, I, wow. I've been playing for like 20 minutes. And none, none of the other lobbies reacted that hard to that. I've, I like at most I got like three people saying something. But yeah, I'm also gonna be talking about what it actually like, ha what actually happens, from my own experience. That guy flew so far. So it tends to happen whenever I play unnicked with like my cosmetics or whatever. Uh, people don't really know how to react. Some people get a very strong bloodlust, and it only my kill will quench it. So they me across the map they look for my cage and they just go for me and like they will literally run across mid run through mid chest run through people uh just to get some uh, some action oh i'm dead here oh no i'm not and uh they're of course the uh most of the time anyways the uh toxic gamers that once you get a kill they see your flex kill and uh and they'll say like go they'll say like the usual one-liners that everyone talks about oh well, let me give him some stuff he wants to like duel there you go i'll let him get that stuff and get prepared because wholesome games are way better than all the sweaty ones i've been dealing with today and if you don't know i literally just stopped uh live streaming the eight hour live uh live stream today so let's go it was a huge success in a way that oh, my community is freaking awesome and i loved every minute of it man even though i had so many internet issues that stream Oh, he wants to be ready to fight. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm dead here. Right. Oh, how wholesome. GG's. But yeah, people usually just say the usual one-liners you see across the internet, like, go outside, touch some grass. You know, thing, like, every, like, I've, the amount of times I've heard those is so annoying. It's, like, just so boring. It's like, guess, just, you find something else to say. Like, I'm not mad because I'm offended. I'm mad because you're boring. Like, come up with something else. Like, if you want to insult me, at least, like, be original. Because I'm open to I'm open to insults, man. I don't even know why I'm mining. This guy's just, like, he was just camping there. So I was like, might as well make some uh, use of my time while I wait for regen. Oh, uh, look, we crafted a helmet. I'm the ultimate miner. I'm, the, like, so likes to the biggest hypocrite ever. Another type of people I meet are the people that actually know me. So they're like, oh my god, screenshot, you know, things like that. It has nothing to do with really my, fl uh, being, like, my cosmetics or anything. But, man, they're also wholesome, too. <laughs> Yeah, this is your reminder. Be wholesome. Oh, he, oh, um, he's bee hopping. That's great. But I would say that there is a lot of target when it comes to projectiles. I mean, cosmetics. I'm sorry. Like if I'm nicked right now and I have my current setup of uh, cosmetics, then I would get targeted to all end or just de nicked because I have flex kills, so they'll easily know like, oh, this someone's easily in the top hundred of for Skywars kills. Let me just look them up. And then they'll just go match the kills, and then they'll, like, party me and message me and all that. And be like, blah, blah, blah. And then, you know, usually people that have the time uh, to de-nick will just uh, be toxic. They won't be, like, any wholesome. They won't be wholesome at all. So, yeah, I don't accept, I don't ever accept those party invites if I've been de-nicked because they're, they're, they have no intention of being uh, wholesome at all. So I just, well, at least for the most part. So I just stay away from that. Oh, we got a farmer. This guy really wants to throw off my absorption. Oh, he's debagging. Oh, and he's dead. But, uh, man, there are limitless amount of interactions that you can have when you have, like, these quote-unquote high-end cosmetics. I still think they're just cosmetics. And I tend to, I used to avoid using them because of the, the target and attention it brings to myself in the games. Like, uh, I don't know, I just don't think it's fun to be targeted. Well, at least that's what I used to think. But now I'm actually kind of lucky. It's actually pretty fun. <laughs> like, it gives you a whole different 
I guess, side of Sky Wars. Like, it, it makes you have different playstyles because you have to adapt to people targeting you on the fly. But yeah, like, we, without, with using these, it's never nothing, you know? There's always going to be, like, every game, someone will either, like, call it out, mention it, or, like, anything. There are a lot of over-expectations whenever someone sees a high star. Like, they expect me to be trying like my life is on the line because I don't think there's a single person that's that doesn't do that at this star. Like, they try and win every single game. Me, I really, really could not care less if uh, I become the victor of the match or not. I just play and mess around, you know? Although I do want to start trying. I, I don't think it's in my blood, man. Yeah, I do actually like playing Unnicked sometimes. I don't know. Like, whenever I'm MVP Plus and have, I'm forced to play Unnicked, it's always the worst experience. But whenever I'm MVP Plus Plus and play Unnicked, it's the best experience. It's just like, how does that always line up that way, you know? He didn't block up his entrances. Exit, so whatever. Yeah, actually, I really like this kill effect. It's so good. Oh, he's in full mid gear. And yeah, I just can't even touch him. But yeah, it's a it's like a Tuesday night or something. Uh, people are just wholesome. I'm not gonna be getting too many of the toxic ones. I actually did get one, but I don't think I'm gonna be using it. Well, if you saw it, then you saw it. But if you didn't, then you didn't. This is gonna be my last game. I'm sorry if it's very short, but uh, yeah, I just played Skywars for like nine hours. This guy that hits from so far away. Oh, it's a farmer too. Yeah, this guy hits from very, very far. He's not uh, hes not cheating or anything. He's just like, he clicks really fast or something. Oh, that guy mined diamonds. I'm getting targeted here instead of the, the guy that mined. I'm pretty sure this guy's on wind streak or something. I'm going to wait until he chronos. Oh, I guess he doesn't have it. Yeah, he didn't have it. GG's. <laughs> he ran into a fire that was, <laughs> was in the sky. That's so unlucky. But uh, that miner, you can tell his intentions weren't bad. Because uh, he had enough to make uh, some pants and a sword. So he could have easily made a chest plate and won that game if he wanted to. That was a wholesome, wholesome miner. He's actually really good, too. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys soon. Goodbye.